up? It's Amber. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. And if you are new here, you should definitely subscribe. An airplane would go by as I'm trying to film this video. Thanks. Bye. Anyway, it is Tuesday, August 20th, and it is currently 1.20 p.m., and I decided I kind of wanted to get my life together today. I'm gonna be cleaning out my closet, and I figured I would vlog, because truly, I feel like I miss vlogging so much. I used to weekly vlog, and I absolutely loved doing that, and I will definitely do that again. But also, if you've been around for a while, you would know that at the beginning of this year, I moved back home, you know, like I just went through a huge major life transition, and I just didn't feel comfortable daily vlogging yet. I just was not at that space where I was ready to like take you guys along with my day-to-day -day life. Anyway, so today's video, I'm gonna be cleaning out my closet because I want to upload a video decorating my room for fall. I have a list of things that I said, Amber, you need to get these things done before you can decorate room for fall. And I really wanna decorate so badly, so I knew that this would make me do the things I need to get done. But anyway, yeah, Tundi's currently passed up behind me because we're just done for the day. Let's get to cleaning my closet and then I also am hoping that I can list some of my clothing online. I think I'm gonna start selling some of my clothes on Poshmark. Let's go hop into my closet. <laughs> I love you. She wants no part in my games. She's like, can you leave me alone? Sorry. So this is my closet. The lighting is not the best in here because I have like the freaking creepy horror movie lighting in this closet. If you guys didn't see, I do have a closet tour. I'll have it linked up above, so go click on that. But anyway, so I have some of my pants and skirts up there. I have so many clothes in here. Clothes that I don't wear and I don't have any room in my dresser because that's full of crap I don't need to. <laughs> but anyway, I have my bags hung here, which I do need to go through as well. I don't know if you can sell accessories online, but I might sell some stuff. This is my fanny pack from Sweetener Tour, good times. So I'm just gonna go through this and clean it out. I wore a bathrobe, that way in case I need to take photos in any of the clothing to, you know, put online to sell, but I can do that. So yeah, let's get to cleaning. This is one of my favorite things ever. This is a hanger that my best friend Margo made for me on her wedding. It's literally the cutest thing in the whole world. Like I'm obsessed and this is what I hang my bathrobe on. The bathrobe I'm wearing has an A on the back, which you can't really see, but she also made me this robe and it's so cute. So yeah, I keep that in here. First dress that we're definitely selling is this one here. It's so cute, but like I wore it once and it's just not really for me. Cause she's cute, but like not for me. Um. I actually love this dress, but it still has the tags on it, and I just don't think I'm ever gonna wear it. That one's gonna go. Plus, if I get rid of some dresses, I get to buy some more dresses, which is just the best part. And then I also have this Victoria's Secret crew neck that my cousin Haley actually got for me, but I just don't wear it that often. I might keep it for the fall and like crop it maybe, and then I'll probably wear it. So that one I think I'm gonna keep. The next dress I think I'm gonna sell is this red one and it has like a super cute, how am I gonna get this in the frame? It has like this super cute cutout in the middle. Oh my God, this is so difficult. The back is really cool too. This we're gonna sell. I wore it once or twice, just not for me. This is another item that unfortunately has to go. Um, it's so cute, but like realistically, I don't think I will ever have a place to wear this. It has a huge bow on the front. It literally looks like a Christmas present. I wished that I could pull off this girly cute dress, but I just cannot, so. It still has the tags on it. Mm. So sad. Then we have this super cute romper and it has this cute little tie that goes around the waist, but I just hung it on the top of the hanger. Really comfortable silky cloth underneath. So it's not just like uncomfortable lace. And then the sleeves are a little bit longer than your average short sleeve. I love this, but I've only worn it once. I wore it in Miami to my first trip ever to Miami. So you might've seen that in the vlog if you watched that vlog. Sadly, that one has gotta go. Oh, I have my sweetener thank you next hoodie. I love this one. This of course is not going anywhere, sorry. I think I might also sell this. It's a two-piece set and it has like really cute off the shoulder sleeves But it also has a strap too so it won't fall off which is super cute It's a flowy crop top and it has floral pattern on it and the shorts are the same type deal But they're high-waisted so I'm definitely gonna try to get rid of that. What is next? This is another dress I wore once and will never probably wear again. This is the front of it. It's just very weird It's not flattering on me. So we're gonna get rid of that one. Another one I think I'm gonna get rid of is this cream colored dress. Tundi's just watching me like, girl, what are you doing? You're such a good girl, Tundi. I love you so much. Tundi loves to just sit here and like watch me when I'm in my closet. When I'm getting ready or whatever, she'll just watch me and it's so cute. So this is what we got so far, making progress. We got some items that are gonna be for sale. Ooh, I bet I could put my camera up here. That would be a cool angle. We're getting innovative. 
It's okay, Tundi. Tundi's barking at the guys that are outside doing work on our house. It's okay, Tundra. It's just the guys working on our house. That's better. I don't know if you'll be able to see me though. Okay, I don't know. I don't even know what is good with this angle, but whatever. I think I'm also gonna get rid of this jacket here. It's like a green, army green jacket with a hood. And it's super cute, but like, I don't know. I need a new one is what I need. Like I love all these things, but I've worn them too much. So that's going in the clothing to get rid of pile. Um, 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 um. I'm thinking about getting rid of this shirt. It reminds me of Blue's Clues, and that's not why I wanna get rid of it. I actually love it, but I wore it once. Green's not really my color. So I don't know, I might get rid of this one. We'll think about it. There's this sweatshirt that I wore once. It says normal is boring all over it. And it's really cute, but again, I just don't know about this one. I kind of want to burn a candle in here. I just don't have anything I could wear this with. So I think I'm going to get rid of that one too. We're going to be burning the candle that looks like the God is a Woman music video. It smells like rose and it's so beautiful. I feel like this angle is so unflattering. I'm going to be getting rid of this adorable top. This is a peplum style off the shoulder top and it is so cute. It was so pretty last fall. I remember I wore this to go apple picking with my baby cousins and it was so fun. There's actually a vlog up of that so I'll link it. I'm either gonna give this away or ask my sister if she wants it. It's kind of like bodycon black dress. So I don't really rock that because your girl's got too many curves for that kind of dress. Yeah, that's that. So that's it for the top rack. Now I just have to go through the bottom rack, which is mostly summer clothes. So I'm probably gonna be keeping all of it. We'll see. Okay, so for the bottom shelf, the only thing I think I'm gonna get rid of is this cute crop top. I just have like worn the heck out of this and I just really can't even deal with it anymore. I think I might give it to my sister though because she actually comes in and borrows this a lot. So. And then, oh, here's my iconic outfit from Sweetener Tour. Oh my God, <laughs> who do I think I am? No, but I wore these camo Fashion Nova pants and they are high-waisted and so cute. Like I am obsessed with these. And then I wore this top with it. This I wore to the New York City Madison Square Garden show. The pants I wore to Miami and to the Madison Square Garden show. But this outfit was so cute and so comfy and this shirt is just adorable. Definitely keeping that, sorry. Maybe someday this will go for sale on my Poshmark, I don't know. I think I'm also gonna get rid of this cream crop top this is another one that I've just worn the heck out of it's so comfy and so cute actually it looks like there's a little black stain on the back my battery's dying what else is new okay so this is it for the clothes that I'm getting rid of for now that is what we got so far so I have to go through and take pictures of all of these items and hopefully sell them online how the f do I turn live photos off <gasps> dude I don't want live photo on ever Okay, you guys, don't mind my mom vacuuming. She is gonna vacuum for the next like 30 minutes, so I'm not waiting that long. But I just put up my first listing, and I'm so excited about it. I'll show you. Also, can we admire how cute Tundee Bear looks right now, just sleeping over there? Anyway, this is my first listing. Oh, I should probably turn down this so I don't get copyright. This is my Poshmark closet. It's this beautiful, like, magenta. In this picture, it looks like dark purple slash red, but it's really like a bright magenta color. And I posted a bunch of photos of it, and then a couple photos of me in it at the end, just so people can see what it looks like on. But I don't know, I wanna make this whole closet like my aesthetic, you know, like with the lights and the candle burning. So I don't know how people typically do this. I've never used an online shopping app, but like I hope that that suffice for people. So go follow me on Poshmark and see if you wanna shop any of these items that we are gonna have going up. All right, you guys, time to take photos of the next item. I hope that angle is okay and I hope to God that my camera doesn't fall on my candle because that would suck. Majorly. Oh God. Shit. The guys that are doing the roof are outside my window right now. Oh, what the heck? This is just what would happen. Yeah. I'm trying to film a video and the guys doing the roof are right outside my fucking window right now. I'm literally in my closet trying on clothes. <laughs> Now I have to shut my curtains and lose my light source. Oh, oh my God, look at this. Oh my freaking God. They came back from their lunch break and they're right outside my window. What the f This is so annoying. At least I got one done. So I guess we're gonna take a quick intermission. I can't believe this shit. Are you kidding me? Oh, all right. Well, I guess I am going to go downstairs for a little bit. 
Okay, you guys, I decided to take a break from the whole closet cleaning because it's about 5 o'clock p.m. right now. And I figured, you know what, like, let's just make this a really fun vlog. So I'm about to go get some fall decor for my room and I'm gonna try to decorate for fall. I figured I would just make this a fun random vlog. So let's go do some shopping. All right, y'all, we are at the first stop. It is Target, the best ever. I'm of course in the makeup section. This is definitely my favorite section in Target. Oh my God, so pretty. My Target was a fail. They have no fall stuff. All right, so Target had nothing fall, and I'm really, really sad because usually they're so ahead of the game. So I guess I'm gonna try TJ Maxx or Home Goods and see what I can find. And then I'm gonna stop and get some food because I'm starving. I contemplated getting a pumpkin coffee, but I kind of want to get chips and guacamole from my favorite place ever. So I think I'm gonna do that instead. But um, first, let's go try to find some freaking fall decor. We out here. I knew I came to the right place for fall decor. Look at how beautiful, oh my god. I really want a fall candle and I already see a few. That might be good. Oh, that one smells amazing. I think I'm gonna get this one. Pumpkin spice. Can't go wrong with traditional. That's really cool. Ended up finding another candle. I love this one. All right, you guys, I'm home now. It's much later. I went out to dinner with one of my good friends, Katie. She is so sweet. I'm so glad she kept me company. I just wanted to eat with someone and she was there for me. Anyway, I'm about to burn this fall candle and I'm gonna binge watch some YouTube videos that I need to catch up on. And yeah, so let's light this candle. I'm gonna keep this one next to my bed. Okay, you guys, it is time for bed. I'm about to do my skincare and I figured I would vlog it since, you know, this is a, <laughs> a vlog of my day and I've barely done anything fun. So I'm so sorry if this was boring. I'm gonna take a cotton round. Okay, my area is just too congested right now. I'm taking a cotton round out of my adorable little cotton round holder. My friend Sophia actually found this and we both bought one. I'm gonna take my simple micellar water and I got these exfoliating cotton rounds and they're so amazing because they really just like get your skin going, you know? It just wakes my skin up and makes me feel so good. That's like disgusting, ew. I'm getting a new one and I'm just gonna put some more micellar water on it. This time I'm putting it on the soft side, not the exfoliating side. And I'm just gonna get whatever makeup is left that didn't come off the first time. I have all my clothes behind me that need to still be, you know, photographed and then uploaded to Poshmark, which by the way, I'm about to check my Poshmark. So we'll see if I got any action today on my post. So I'm taking a third cotton round now. This is getting a bit excessive. And I'm taking my toner. This is the Indie Lee toner. This is my lazy girl skincare routine, by the way. Usually I like do a full facial wash with my clean and clear cleanser. I don't exactly know the name, but I've mentioned it a bunch of times. And usually I take off my makeup with a makeup wipe, but I only had eyebrow makeup on, so I didn't feel it was necessary. And then I just usually put this toner all over my face because it's amazing. But yeah, so my skin feels pretty clean. This is definitely not like the deepest clean that I could be getting, but like I said, your girl's lazy. Your girl just went out and had some heavy dinner. I had a burger. Oh my God, it's been so long since I had a, like a real burger and it was good, but your girl's gonna be paying for it really soon if you know what I mean. Okay, I'm gonna check my Poshmark real quick. 30 notifications, oh my God. I got a ton of people who shared my listing. I somehow got a lot of followers, like I'm confused. Since I have 99 followers already, what the heck? That's crazy, I just made it this morning. And yeah, I don't think anything's happened so far. Like I don't think anyone's wanted to buy my dress, which is unfortunate, <laughs> but it's fine. It's really late, I really wanna go to bed. I'm probably gonna edit this vlog for a little bit and then go to sleep 
I'm burning my fall candle on my nightstand, which I'm obsessed with my nightstand. It's a little cluttered right now because usually I don't have this mug or like I have an abundance of drinks here. And of course I'm obsessed with the lights behind my bed. I think they're so twinkly and romantic and pretty and I love them. But anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna go to bed. Oh, I almost forgot to do shout out of the week. What the heck is wrong with me? So let's go online and choose a shout out of the week, shall we? This week's shout out of the week goes to Callum Murphy on Instagram. He always posts pictures every single week, just like that, watching my videos and I'm so thankful. So shout out to you, boo. Thank you so much for the support. But yeah, good night from Tundi and I. Good morning guys and happy, where's my phone? I don't know what day it is. Happy August 21st. I figured I would carry on the vlog from yesterday because to be honest, I'm not even really quite sure if anything entertaining came out of that vlog. I haven't edited it yet. Come on, what the f Anyway, so I'm getting ready to go get a shake with my sister Morgan as I do. If you guys follow me on social media, you would see that I get these shakes every single day. They're so amazing. It's at this nutrition club that opened up near me by one of my dear friends and it is amazing. And I'm actually doing a challenge currently where I go down the whole entire board in order and order every single flavor. And I'm almost done with the challenge and it's just been really fun. So me and my sister Morgan and Tundi are about to go do that. And then I will be back and we will see where the day takes us. But for right now I was about to do my eyebrows and then I'm good to go because I always at least need my eyebrows done I feel like I look less like a trash bag when I do my eyebrows of course like this is so difficult to vlog eyebrows are done and I will get dressed and show you guys my outfit hi Tundi girl I love you so much what a good baby. This is my outfit today. I'm wearing this black cropped tank top, this oversized, like, I don't even know what this is considered. It's kind of like an oversized flannel. I don't know, but I'm wearing these acid washed high-waisted shorts. They're so cute. These are from Fashion Nova. I'm pretty sure my friend Kelly gave me these. Morgan got mint chocolate chip today. I got salted caramel. All right, y'all, we are going shopping. We're checking out the fall stuff at Bath and Body Works as a family. Good girl. Look at these cute pumpkins. I kind of want one. Oh, it's a magnet. I don't really buy candles unless they're on sale. How much are these little pumpkins though? I kind of want this. Only five bucks. I think I'm gonna get the white one. You sniffing the pumpkin? No. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna get this candle holder that Morgan just pointed out to me. It's so cute. This is what we got. We got the goods. When I checked out, the lady was like, are you ready for fall? And I'm like, yes, as it's like August 20th today. We're getting there though, before we know it'll be Vlogmas. I'm home now. I immediately got into my AG26 hoodie. This is Ariana's birthday collection merch and I love it. It's so comfortable. It's honestly my favorite merch I've gotten by her. It's not including the H&M merch though, cause that stuff was good too. So I'm home now and I desperately have to clean my room. Like there's so much clutter everywhere. I still have a couple birthday presents and things that I bought here and I have to clean up this corner. Oh my God, it's such a mess. I just have had no room for any more clothes because obviously we already discussed how I need to get rid of some clothes. And luckily my sisters came in and grabbed a couple of things out of here. So it reduced my pile. I'm just gonna play some music on my computer. I will show you guys what I got at Bath and Body Works. First thing I got, Bath and Body Works haul. I literally had coupons here that I should have brought. I had 20% off your purchase, free body care item. Oh, and they expire soon. Anyway, I got this little candle holder. It's so cute. I'm probably gonna put it out now. I just don't know where, but it's so adorable. It has little pumpkins on it. It has like adorable fall leaves and it's just so gorgeous. Then another thing that caught my eye was this little white sparkly pumpkin. I just think it's so beautiful. I love how sparkly it is and it's just very me. That's what I got. I'm gonna leave it in the bag for now. I'm just gonna let it sit here and take up more space in my room. Hi, Tenton. Oh. 
I love you with all my heart. I was just about to sit here by my window and paint my nails. I'm painting it my signature white. This is my favorite shade of white. This is just shade Blanc by Essie. Such a good white. I just love this one so much. And then I use the Essie gel top coat and I love this. Hundy's just watching me. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys. I got this for my birthday from my uncle. This is like one of Ariana Grande's biographies and it's kind of cool. This is the bag that my mom's present for me came in, which is kind of a funny story. Story. My mom and dad actually got me an oversized t-shirt for my birthday because if anyone knows me, you know, literally forever I've only ever worn big clothing to bed. Like I wear a big t-shirt or a big sweatshirt literally since I was a kid. I just can't sleep in pants. I'm so weird, but I cannot sleep in pants. The only time I'll ever sleep in pants is if I'm extremely tired and about to pass out or drunk and passed out. <laughs> Something about like the friction of the pants rubbing up against the blanket just makes me really uncomfortable. My legs need to be free at night. I'm a weirdo. But anyway, so my parents got me an oversized t-shirt because the t-shirt that I was wearing to bed forever now was a giant oversized New England Patriots t-shirt and it has holes in it everywhere because it's literally older than me. There is a photo somewhere of my mom wearing this exact shirt when me and my sisters were little. Like it's my dad's shirt I think that she inherited that then I inherited and now it's holy. I'm gonna show you it actually. I don't even know, they might have hid it on me. They might have gotten rid of it already. Okay, so this is the shirt they got me for my birthday. It'll get bigger too, like it'll stretch out over time. And then this is the old one. That was a hole right in the middle of my chest. So my parents wrote this note that was like, we thought it was time for a new sleep shirt. Stop flashing us with a winky face. Because literally there's a giant hole in my chest. There were holes in the armpits. Like I just, you know when you just can't let go of something because it's sentimental. Oh well. So now I have a new one and I wore it to bed last night. I don't know if I vlogged in it already today. <laughs> Sorry, I'm really, no brain cells left up here. I'm telling you people. That's the story, super cute. So anyway, I'm gonna paint my nails. I just wanted to vlog really quickly. I'm gonna probably watch a YouTube video on my phone. I always put my phone right here on my windowsill and I watch YouTube videos while painting my nails. I just love being near my window. I just love being able to like feel the fresh air and be one with nature, you know, such a hippie. I have all my birthday cards on display because I'm such a sentimental ass bitch and I just really can't get rid of anything. This is actually a birthday card that my grampy made me. He always makes us our cards, which is so, so sweet. And he put 23 beers on here for me for my 23rd birthday. So so I absolutely love my Grammy and Grampy. I'm gonna be taking a vacation with them to Disney in October. I'll be vlogging it, don't you worry. And then this is the most beautiful card ever from my best friend Kelly. Oh my God, I'm so obsessed with it. And she's just so awesome. Like I just love the aesthetic of this card. Shout out to Kelly if she's watching this. I love her so much. Yeah, of course my uncle got me a friends card with my Ariana book because he knows me so well. Miss uh, Birkin, size 25, with Palladium hardware. Miss my sister just got home and I could hear through the window that the construction guys were asking her to move my car and she called me literally right after but I'm standing here at the window and I'm like hi if I give, throw you down the keys will you move it? So I just threw her my keys through my window and she caught them down there and moved my car. Good times. Hi, you're so cute. I have some visitors. Miss Rosie, she always loves to get up on my beanbag chair and she just sits here because she's such a good girl, huh? And Tundi's just chilling over there. But I was looking at these pictures and I saw this one over here this one right here this is me currently waiting for fall all right you guys it is 12 33 it's time for a lunch break let's go make some lunch Tundi I need to pause my music who remembers in the sweetener tour vlog when I was like, there's a crater in my front yard? Well, look at this. We literally have had our roof being worked on. That's our life here. And then let's do an update on my orchids from Kelly. I just watered them yesterday or fed them, whatever you want to call it. But they're so pretty. Like I'm so obsessed. I want to put them in my room. I don't have any space for them at the moment. So they're going to live here for a little bit. And then these are my flowers from Tyler. They're still living their best life over here. She's a little droopy but that's okay.
go for a walk, Andy. Good girl. This way. It is much later now. It's almost 2 o'clock p.m. I'm home. I'm setting up because I think I'm going to film, actually. I wanted to show you guys. I actually got some new makeup at Target yesterday. I think I vlogged it, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. But anyway, I got this Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. A lot of you guys who follow me on Twitter know I was asking for bronzer recommendations. This one I actually stumbled upon in Target, and it's one that I used so long ago, I feel like. This just looks so familiar. I remember buying that at one point. Then I had to repurchase my Maybelline Fit Me Stick Foundation. Hopefully this is my shade. I've been looking for my summer shade forever and now summer's almost over, so that's great. Then I just bought a new NYX eyebrow pencil because I go through these so fast. I am in the shade Ash Brown. Anyway, and I'm also snacking on my favorite. These are Oreo Thins. These are so, so good, but so bad for you. Oh my God, they're literally chocolate covered Oreos. This one's like only a half of one, but they're so good. I know they're so bad, but I just can't stop. One of my good friends here on YouTube, she has been watching my videos forever. Let me give her a quick shout out. Her name is Gladys, and she messaged me today asking, when are we getting a new video? So I said tonight. I just posted on my story too, so that means your girl needs to get this vlog edited. We are almost set up to film. I just set up my little table where I put all my makeup and I have my cat ears because yes, I am gonna wear these to keep my hair out of my face. That is how I do it here. I'm filming right now. So we have our fall tag going on my phone and I am just sitting here about to film. Love that for us. So this is the final look of my fall get ready with me. I should probably turn down the music a little bit. We get the fall set up back there with my candle and the little wreath thing that I got from Bath and Body Works. And I am about to go edit. I am so happy. I think I'm gonna go get a pumpkin iced coffee though, so. Let's go. Good girl, you ready, Tundi? I, I ain't your girlfriend. Tundi's having such a good time. So anyway, let's chat, shall we? So basically, it is almost fall time. It is August 21st today. I can't even believe that August is almost over, that summer's almost over. Usually when my birthday comes, that's how I know that winter's coming, basically. Here in New England, it goes from summer to and winter so fast but I'm so excited I've been picking out some fall stuff for my room and I'm so excited to do a room tour soon I'm hoping I can do a room tour before my room's like fully covered in fall stuff that way you can see it like in its natural state you know um, but I'm still so excited to decorate for fall so I did just film a fall tag slash get ready with me I love doing videos like that and don't tell me to shut up when you know you talk too much All right, we have arrived at Dunkin' Donuts. Ooh, they already have pumpkin everything. Hi, what's the gift you? Can I please have a small pumpkin iced coffee with almond milk? Anything else to add? Um, no, that's it. All right, thank you. Thank you. Yay, I'm so excited. Two Hi. 256. 256. Okay, you guys. That is amazing, holy sh I am so glad we did this. Dunkin Donuts pumpkin iced coffee is superior, okay? I'm home now and I'm currently going to sit down and edit for a little bit. I'm gonna edit the drive with me that I just filmed. I'm hoping I can either get the drive with me or the fall get ready with me up tonight. I'm not sure which one, but I at least wanna have a video up tonight. I don't even know what this vlog has turned into, but I hope it's at least entertaining. Whole squads here. Hell yeah. We're about to eat. We're all done at dinner. Morgan got a dessert to go. And the sky's literally gray because we are going to have a storm here. I am home now. Time to wipe off this makeup. 
currently editing. This is my setup. I have this beautiful fall arrangement here. This is literally everything I want and more right now. And then I have, of course, my computer set up with my dead flowers. That's also my aesthetic. And then putting this stool here was like the most genius thing ever, especially because my knee's been hurting me so much lately. So elevating it here, I just, ugh, I feel like such a bougie bitch right now. Like, who am I? All right, you guys, it is currently 12.46. I am so exhausted. I literally look like a ratchet mess. My video is finally uploaded. I'll actually show you guys the thumbnail. That is the final thumbnail. I think it's so cute. I kind of love it. It's going to be up by the time this vlog is up. I think I'm going to go lay with Tundi in my bed and turn on those twinkly lights instead of those ones and edit all night and then wake up and I have such an exciting video to film tomorrow. So stay tuned. It might be up before this vlog. I don't know, but it is so exciting. So go check it out. And thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I really hope it was interesting or entertaining at least. Uh, my life's a hot mess and I I literally don't even know what this vlog was. I will find out very soon when I'm editing. But yeah, um, I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.